Today we're taking booze in the kitchen and making coquito. For this recipe, you're gonna need a measuring cup, a ladle, a wooden spoon, a small knife, a cutting board, a measuring spoon, a strainer, a pot, a mixing bowl, a can opener, and bottles with airtight lids. The ingredients are coconut cream, nutmeg, vanilla, cinnamon, sugar, and a good Puerto Rican Añejo rum. Coquito is a traditional Puerto Rican holiday punch. There are a lot of variations and personal touches on this one. The components that seem to remain constant, however, are rum, coconut, and cinnamon. This version is adapted from Giuseppe Gonzalez's recipe on liquor.com. Giuseppe's recipe calls for two cans of unsweetened coconut cream and two cans of sweetened coconut cream. I like to use unsweetened coconut cream exclusively, not only to control the sweetness, but the unsweetened variety tends not to have any additives. With the coconut and rum, it's in the same neighborhood as a pina colada, but the spices definitely give it a Christmas and winter holiday flavor. It's extremely well balanced. The coconut, cinnamon, and rum shine through the most, but the vanilla and nutmeg accent it well. This one has more ingredients than avocado, but is easier to make. It's a punch, so the proportions seem daunting, but scale it as you need it. We're shooting for about 13 cups, or about 3 liters of coquito. That'll make about 18 servings. Let's start by opening our cans of coconut cream. They may have separated, so break it up a little with a spoon. Next, add the coconut to your pot. At this scale, you want to use a pot that holds 3 quarts or more. Next, measure out 2 cups of sugar. Add that to the pot. Measure a tablespoon of nutmeg. Add that to the pot. Take your vanilla bean, split it down the middle lengthwise, and scrape the seeds out with a knife. Add the seeds to the pot and toss in the pods. Next, we'll add our cinnamon sticks. Turn it on medium heat and stir continuously until the sugar and any chunks of coconut cream have been dissolved. Remove the mixture from heat. Strain out the cinnamon sticks and vanilla pods, but hang on to the cinnamon. Let everything cool, crack open your rum, and stir it in. Then I like to ladle the coquito into a measuring cup before bottling it up. Pour it into your airtight bottles, pop a cinnamon stick in each, close the lid, and store it in the fridge. The mixture tends to settle, so shake it or stir it before serving. Pour it over ice in a rocks glass, or in this case, a stemless wine glass. Garnish it with a cinnamon stick, and that's all there is to it. Homemade Coquito. Salud. Click here for more videos. Be sure to subscribe, and don't forget to check us out on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.